Why don't you research interesting music? Whenever colleagues ask me about my research topic, most conversations ended with this question or with similar remarks. Ethnomusicologists thought I better study folk or court music, whereas popular music scholars advised me to go for something more subversive or oppositional. So what is this research topic that seems so dark to others? It's about mainstream pop in Uzbekistan, about a genre called estrada. Estrada is a musical relic of socialism and it became the central tool for what I would call sonic statecrafting in authoritarian Uzbekistan after independence. This, in my opinion, makes it extremely interesting music. But why common binaries such as subversion and affirmation do not help to understand what is at stake and what all this has to do with the Cold War? The answers to these and other questions you will find in my book.